everyone welcome to engineered today we'll discuss about the outturn of the labor uh, from estimation and costing okay so task what is task the capacity of doing work by an artisan or skilled labor in the form of quantity of work per day is known as the task work or outturn of the labor so this is the task work or outturn of the labor is the capacity of doing work by labor skilled labor in the quantity in the form of quantity of work per day how much quantity of work they can do per day so that is the that is the outturn so following may be taken as the approximate quantity of work or outturn for an average artisan per day so for brick work in the lime mortar or cement mortar so in foundation and uh, plinth when the brick work is done in foundation and in plinth using lime mortar or cement mortar then it's 1.25 meter cube per mason per day so and in superstructure it's one and in arches it's 0.55 and when in the case of mod motor in the uh, when the brickwork is done in pound and plinth it's 1.5 more than the when used in uh, lime motor or cement motor right so in superstructure 1.25 and half brick wall in partition is 5 square meter per mason per day so let's see this one is where this one is in super structure right super structure super structure then this 1.25 is in foundation and plinth in in cement motor or lime motor so these two are 1 and 1.25 in lime motor or cement motor right so then 1.5 and 1.25 are in mod motor so more in more in foundation and plinth and less in super structure so remember 1.25 1 and uh, 1.5 so maximum is for mod motor 1.5 and uh, in plinth level and in plinth uh, in foundation and in superstructure it's 1.25 again when using lime motor or cement motor it's more in uh, foundation and plinth that is 1.25 and less in superstructure 1 only 1 and, and in arts less so 0.55 and half brick partition uh, wall in partition it's 5 square meter per mason per day Okay, stone work for the coarse rubble stone masonry. Coarse rubble stone masonry in lime or cement mortar, it's 0 0.8. And for random, random, it has to be more, right? So more than 0 0.8, that is 1. If it's random, it has to be more. When it's coarse, it's less, right? So coarse is 0 0.8, random is 1. And in ashlar masonry, it's less and 0 0.4. And stone arch work is also less, 0 0.4. So three things we need to uh, look here. First is, first is for, this is for random more, right, 1, and second is 0 0.8 for coarse, and 0 0.4 for aslar masonry and stone masonry work. Okay, next. Concrete work, uh, f the first, so let's see in a lime concrete foundation or floor, that is 8.50 uh, cubic meter per mason per day, and if uh, lime concrete is in roof terracing, that is 6 cubic meter per mason per day. And if it's cement concrete, 1 is to 2 is to 4, this is important, this is important, and this is important. 1 to 4, uh, after 4, what uh, after 4 is 5, right? So this is the way to remember 5 cubic meter per mason per day. When it's cement, uh, cement concrete, 1 is to 2 is to 4, it's 5 cubic, because after 4, it comes 5. So uh, and uh, 2.5 cement concrete floor, it's 7.50, okay? So, for reinforced brickwork, it's one similar to what? Similar to super structure, right? Super structure in cement and lime, cement and lime concrete. Let's see again. Let's see here. Look at here. Lime motor or cement motor in super structure, it's one, right? So similar to this. Similar to this, uh, reinforced brickwork is also one. And for RCC work, it's three meter cube per mason per day and this is also important 12 mm plastering in cement or lime motor it is 8 remember this 12 mm 8 is near to 12 so remember that is 12 is nearer to 8 so almost you can uh, guess the answer pointing with cement or lime motor that is 10 and flagstone floor laying with lime or cement motor it, that is 10 square meter and terrazzo for 6 mm thick mosaic work over 2 cm thick cc it is 5 square meter per mason per day okay 
Now for earthwork, earthwork in excavation in ordinary soil, it's three cubic, sorry, three meter cube. And earthwork in excavation in hard soil is it has to be less, right? So three minus one, two. And in rock, it's one. So it's like three, two, one. Ordinary three and hard two and rock one. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. And sand filling in plinth is four. Sand filling is four, um, in plinth is four. And again another disposal of surplus earth within a lead of 30 meter. 30 meter for this, for this, one mazdur can do 2.83 cubic meter per day. So remember this, one mazdur can do 2.83 cubic meter per day. Let's see some questions. The quantum of work of any item or skill labor is supposed to turn out in a day is known as its task work. Again, next question. The expected outturn of cement concrete 1, 2, 4 per mason per day is the idea is after 4. What comes after 4? It's 5. So, answer is our answer is 5. <coughs> next, the expected outturn of 2.5 centimeter cement concrete floor per mason per day is it's 7.5 square meter. Next, the expected outturn of half brick partition wall per mason per day. So, the trick is half brick is half means 0 0.5, right? Half is 0 0.5. So, reverse this 5.0. So, answer is 5.0. The expected outturn of brickwork in cement motor in foundation and plinth per mason per day. So, it's foundation and plinth and cement motor. In foundation and plinth, uh, the outturn is more, right? More. And in cement motor, so it's 1.25 meter. So this is cube meter cube. Next, the expected outturn for earthwork in excavation in ordinary soil per workman per day is 3 meter cube. And the expected outturn of 12 mm plastering with cement motor is nearer to 8. Sorry, nearer to 12. It's 8 square meter. And how many mazdurs will be required for the disposal of 30 cubic meter cube of surplus earth within a lead on 30 meter in one day? It's 30. How? So one mazdur can dispose 2.83 cube meter cube per day. And uh, when we divide uh, 30 by this value, we'll get 10 mazdurs can dispose 30 meter cube per day. And then expected outturn um, of reinforced brickwork per mason per day is it's one. In which of the flowing works, the work turned in cubic meter per mason per day will be the least. So it's stone arts work. Thank you for watching.